Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. This is Cha Cha and today I'm going to show you how to make YouTube intro using Keynote on your iPhone and your iPad. So please keep on watching. So if you have an iPad or iPhone, go ahead and look for this symbol. This is your keynote symbol and it's already built in in your iPad or in your iPhone. So in this tutorial, I'm going to use iPad. So go ahead and click keynote symbol and all of these will be shown after you click the keynote symbol. These are the different themes that you can use to create your YouTube video and just choose whatever you want on this one. For my YouTube intro, I use the Renaissance theme. So once you click this one, this will be the image that will be showing on your screen. So you will be seeing two boxes here one is for the title and the other one is for whatever words you want to put it so on this first box you have to double tap so that you can write whatever words you want on this line For my second box, I'm going to use my YouTube name and I'm going to place this all the way here in the bottom. And I'm going to move this first box as well all the way here in the bottom. And once you're happy with the placement of these two boxes, Let's go ahead and animate this. So by clicking this box, it will show you the word animate. So you click that word animate and all of these things that you are seeing in the bottom, these are your choices on how you can animate your first box. Like on this case, I like to use the shimmer. So shimmer is my add-in animation. So now I can add action as my second animation. And this time I'm using flip. Let's go ahead and animate the second box and let's select shimmer as our build in. Now on the second box or first box, you can add pictures. Like on my second box, I like to use my logo picture and I'm going to place it next to my YouTube name right here. And guess what? You can animate this picture also. So since we're using the shimmer, I'm going to go ahead and use it for all of the images that I'm putting here. Now that you know how to add picture, let's add more pictures above the first box. So click that plus sign above, then select picture that you want to use. Now you can put whatever pictures or images you want to use. But in my case, I like the picture of food since my YouTube channel also talks about food. 
Now go ahead and animate this picture. Then click done, then add another picture. Once you have selected the picture that you want to use, remember you can make adjustment. Like if you don't like um, the small size, definitely change it and you can make adjustment that looks good on your screen now if you're happy with your results go ahead and animate it and again i am using shimmer to animate my images and now it is time to look for your final picture that you want to use. You got your final picture and definitely you can make changes now or arrangement or if you want to change the placement of all these pictures please do so and if not go ahead and animate the last picture If you want to add more pictures on this, you can. If you want to add more wordings on this, you can. But for me, this is my final look. And I'm just making arrangement and see if pictures balance or does it look good. If, if it is good to you, done. Let's go ahead and view the final look of this creation. So to play this video, click that play button on the top right hand side. So that is your first screen and now we are ready for the second screen and go ahead and click the plus button in your left hand side for your second screen. Same on your first screen, double tap so that you can write wordings on the box. This is my second screen. Let's click animate, add build in, then select shimmer, then click done. Let's add another action. Click animate again, select flip, then click done. Now let's go ahead and add my logo picture. Choose photo. Look for that picture. This is the one that we used earlier on my first screen, that tiny bitty picture that we put on the second box. So the same image that I'm using here. Make some adjustment, done. Once you're happy with it, click your picture. Click animate, select shimmer click done now let's add some action click the picture click animate select your action now this one i'm using pulse click pulse click done that's it and now let's go ahead and click that play button to see what our second screen looks like 
There you go. This is our second screen. If you are satisfied with your first and second screen, go ahead and click export, click movie. Change your slide and build after two seconds. But if you like quick movement, then leave it to one second. After making the changes, it will download to create a movie. Once you exported it to a movie, don't forget to save that video. And that video will appear in your photo gallery. When you click save video, exit your keynote, open your photo gallery so that you can review that video. And then go ahead and just play it. Now let's add music, click edit, select iMovie, click music or note symbol located in the right hand side all the way in the bottom. Select your songs that you like to use. Once you found your music or your song, click plus symbol to add music to this video. Then play. Thank you guys for watching this video. I hope you like this tutorial and please don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel.